this is my topic, uh, left bundle branch pacing facilitates by Nova surface ACG in comparison with the uh, EP system. And this is my disclosure. Uh, firstly, I will show uh, uh, a video. In the sec uh, 100 uh, second video, I used the headset camera to record the surgical, the total surgical procedure, uh, which allowed me to uh, uh, catch all details, including uh, body surface monitors, PSA display, and X ray. Uh, imagine we could uh, first say a full channel. For China, uh, body surface is displayed on the monitor, and the top one uh, is the V1 followed by V5 and two and three limb leads and the charge speed at uh, 50 millimeter per second. The pa uh, the patient heart rate was uh, uh, sinus bradycardiac just uh, 45, 47 beats per minute, and the native QRS uh, uh, was narrow. First of all, I was mapping uh, the his bound area. The pacing mapping uh, is performed on the X-ray. Uh, imagine after finding the his uh, bound uh, and uh, the his bound can capture, we can uh, observe in the uh, this blight this is not uh, captured, and this is uh, capture his bundle. I kept the X ray uh, imagined as a mask. Uh, PSA also uh, showed obvious uh, the, uh, his bundle uh, uh, potential after a big A uh, H wave, and uh, his uh, threshold was about three. Uh, void uh, for uh, preliminary uh, test. Step two, uh, we uh, moved the lead to the uh, to do the LBB pacing uh, and pacing uh, thirty eight and thirty leads at the site uh, of the distal right ventricular septum. We noticed uh, uh, whether the extra uh, of the two and uh, three um, uh, limb leads is uh, similar to the extra uh, access of the native QIS. Uh, at the same time, observed whether the position under the X-ray image uh, is about one centimeter as a uh, far uh, area of the his bundle area. And I can deep uh, screw the lead in the processor. Uh, of screwing, we can observe to continue the morphological change uh, of prime um, prime speeds, and the electrode depths can be uh, monitored. Uh, the um, parameter testing uh, after screwing expect uh, except to pay attention uh, to the unipolar import, uh, impedance and more important to uh, change the output voltage. We can see the LVAT to after V5 uh, is significant uh, shortened after high voltage. Uh, we can see the, uh, the, the changes. And uh, the changes uh, show the uh, capture to the conduction system. Uh, from the LV septal pacing to the non-selective LBB pacing. At the uh, time, we can observe the large uh, LBB potential, uh, potential, LBB potential, yes, uh, yeah, big LBB potential uh, in the PSA display. Uh, this is the if the parameters are satisfied. Finally, uh, we withdraw the deliver sheets to the right uh, edge. Uh, and uh, uh, the the his bounder EGM the recording sync by EP system is invisible. Uh, 
uh, to the operator. Post uh, operation, we can check again in the record. The EGM shows a uh, clear uh, his bounder potentials never capture. Uh, this never capture to the uh, capture his bounder. And uh, uh, this is a premature uh, beats uh, during the schooling, the uh, 38 and 38. And uh, uh, when we pacing it, we can uh, decrease the, the uh, output. We can find the uh, capture the LBB uh, and to the LB, um, LV sector pacing, different LV80 from the uh, 68 millisecond to the 882 millisecond. And this is dif uh, different. Uh, L, uh, different uh, uh, depths, uh, we can observe different LBB potential from sm small potential without uh, injury current, and this is big uh, LBB potential, and uh, they have the uh, more uh, better uh, uh, threshold of uh, capture LBB. This is non-selective to selective LBB pacing. Uh, when degrades the Output from the one voice to the 0.8 voice uh, has the same uh, LV80 time. Uh, uh, so uh, this is our study's uh, background and aims. Uh, the LVB pacing in clinical practice has grown rapidly. At present, uh, most uh, uh, performed the LVB. Uh, pacing processual uh, we using and uh, EP system, but uh, parts of the hospital or centers do not have the EP system for LBB implantation. Uh, so limiting the adoption in routine clinical practice. Uh, Rust the object of the study was to assess the feasibility and safety of the LBB uh, pacing procedure by uh, simplified uh, just uh, four lead uh, body surface ECG monitor and PSA. And this is a single center's prospective study. And the patient was follow up for at least uh, three months after the operation, uh, including pacing parameters, echo, and uh, uh, complications. And the main inclusion criteria is an indication for uh, treatment of body or, car, uh, or uh, CRT. And the exclusion criteria, including uh, ischemic cardiomyopathies, non IVCD patients, and uh, ventricular septal hypertrophy, and the uh, septal sickness is over 50 millimeters. Uh, and the pacemaker upgrade patients. And this um, study used a uh, five uh, electrode monitor cable with four channel display. The right arm uh, electrode was placed uh, on right shoulder, showed, and uh, the left arm electrode was placed on the right force and or third uh, uh, intercrossed uh, space to obtain uh, simulated V1 lead uh, configuration SMS a standard V1. Uh, the left leg electrode and the right uh, leg electrode were uh, placed on left and right lower limbs uh, respectively. The um, five lead uh, V electrode was placed in the standard V5 lead position and we can get a uh, 50 millimeters per second charge speed to observe the clearly the uh, the change of the uh, QRS morphology and LV80. And this is the study flow chart. Uh, during the operation, the LBB uh, pacing confirmation by simplified the uh, four leads ECG and uh, uh, PSA was conduction by the operator naked eye uh, assessment. At the same time, the operator was blind to the EP system uh, that was conducted by engineers 
uh, in EP measurement at the end of the uh, operation, the consistency between the operator's uh, judgment of LBB pacing and uh, engineer, uh, uh, engineer's LBB uh, pacing confirmation was determined. And uh, we can uh, uh, observe the different uh, the LBB patient with injury current. Uh, this is the a big uh, LBB um, potential with injury current uh, in different uh, in depot uh, septal, and this is a small uh, uh, potentials without injury current. And this has a very high threshold of capture LBB. And uh, this is a result uh, total 143 patients attempt LBB patients include uh, LBB block uh, patients uh, 37 cases and uh, RBB block uh, 15 uh, patients and uh, 91 patients is narrow QIS. The total success rate is almost 96.5%. Uh, and mostly the LBB capture threshold is less than one point uh, volts at 0.5 millisecond. And uh, we can uh, have the highly consistent with uh, EP system by compared with the uh, simplified uh, su surface ECG, the uh, consistent rate is 99.3%. And very few uh, complications in our studies. Uh, there's only um, septal perforations in two cases and intravenous puncture -like, uh, related artery injury one in one case. And this is baseline uh, characteristics. Uh, and we can find in, in all in total patients, the LV ejection fraction is normal, but has a lower uh, ejection fraction in LBB block group and other groups are normal. And uh, the total um, pre, uh, procedure duration is uh, 78 mini, uh, meter, uh, um, 78 meters, but had a little uh, bit longer in uh, left uh, bounder uh, branch block uh, group and right uh, bounder, branch uh, bounder branch block groups uh, has a little bit longer. And this is the result of uh, about consistency with EP system. They can find the uh, no change uh, has no significant uh, uh, difference in changes of surface in that, uh, uh, ECG, uh, including paste RBB block pattern in lead one uh, from non-selective LBB pacing to select LBB pacing and uh, LV septor to the non-selective uh, LBB pacing. But uh, we have a uh, uh, visible abrupt change uh, of stimulate LV80 in V5, uh, the co in, uh, coincidence rate uh, is uh, 91%. And we have the uh, uh, two third uh, cases, we can observe the LBB potential. Uh, uh, and uh, half of them have the uh, co current of injury of the LBB potential. It's uh, just uh, if the potential is more than 0 0.2 millivolts, we can observe the in the PSA displayed. And this is conclusion. Uh, this simplified LBB patient implantation method without an uh, EP system and uh, uh, only rely on uh, simplified body surface ECG combined uh, with PSA is uh, clinically feasible and safe. Uh, the operator must uh, pay attention to the QIS changes uh, during procedure. Uh, 
uh, which are key points that can be observed with the naked eye and uh, judge it whether uh, LBB capture. And the key point is in, uh, in, includes the selected LBB pattern uh, in, in uh, chance to the non-selective LBB pacing pattern and the QIS morphological changes uh, accompanied without uh, with a uh, obviously uh, change of the uh, LVAT. And uh, uh, this is a limitation. Uh, this uh, uh, just a single center study with a sample size of 143 cases. And the study was completed by two experienced operators, Dr. Huang and I. Uh, we did more than 3,000 successful cases uh, of LBB pacing, had a very uh, knowledge about, about the judgment of the LBB capture. And the uh, include patients, uh, we disclose the patients with an uh, ischemic cardiomyopathy, uh, hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, and the non uh, specific IVCD were not included. The criteria um, of the capture uh, LBB among these patients uh, were still unclear and uh, complicated. So, uh, they uh, didn't in, uh, uh, cruise uh, these patients, these count patients. Uh, so this is my uh, presentation. Uh, thanks. Thank you.